This is where every top-level footballer wants to be after a long season. The Champions League final, only two teams left in the battle for Europe's Premier Club competition. My name's Derek Ray, and I'm joined for commentary on this final tonight by Lee Dixon. It's Porto taking on Chelsea. Well, it's an absolute pleasure, Derek, to be here. Very, very lucky indeed to be broadcasting to millions and millions of people, let alone watching this fantastic game. I'm sure the players are a little bit nervous as well with that audience looming in the background, tuning in on their televisions. It's going to be a great night. I'm very excited to be here. Hopefully, we get the game that this tournament deserves. Unable to get a body in the way. Werner, now Alonso. A strong play here on the shielding front. Marcus Alonso. And whipped into the box. Still not clear. Crucial intervention just then amid impending danger. Well, he has to be regarded always as a dangerous opponent, but what should we expect to see from him in this game, Lee? Well, I love watching him. He's got quick feet, quick mind. He wants you to come close to you so he can get past you. So his defenders normally stand off him, and then he's got more time to pick the pass he wants, and he normally finds the best one. An effective challenge. Not a good pass. And the keeper grabs it. Marega. Well, visionary passing. Vital interception. The danger was very real. Reese James. Conte. And across the touchline, so a throw in here. Jihou. Kovacic, and back with Giroud, opportunity to take the lead, splendid defending, and it needed to be, what can he do from here? Giroud, I just missed that little bit of attacking spark, goalkeeper's ball. Rudiger. Mateo Kovacic. Conte now. Still pushing for the goal that would put them ahead, but not forcing it. And with that, the attack fizzles out. Oh, good vision. Real chance. It's got to be. There it is. How about that? for starters well what a huge moment that might be for this club the fans are going absolutely wild well here it is again it's all about the pace in transition they were so quick to get out from the back and he had choices of what type of finish to apply and bang he goes for the smash lovely goal the opening goal of the game then Mount. Possession stats for Chelsea, pretty good. But they have to create more, they have to be more positive. The final third play has been slow, too predictable. Marega. And the keeper taking it cleanly. Marcos Alonso. Conte. It's with Giroud. And return to Kovacic. And he stopped them in their tracks. And threading it forward. He's in behind the defence here. And there it is! A two-goal cushion now. And just look at these fans. The trophy coming their way, surely. Half-time.
45 minutes separating these two sides from glory. The second half of the Champions League final begins. James. Conte. He's given it away. Conte. James. And Golo Conte. Here's Kovacic. Spot on with that tackle. Bodies forward and the break looks on. Just as well from the defensive point of view that he was able to make that interception. Throw-ins given. And a strong tackle. Mateo Kovacic. And we're inside the final 30 minutes. A fine reading of the situation. Excellent ball over the top. Well, that is how to play advantage. Very alert defending to put a stop to the chance. Over the touchline for a throw-in. So, making the substitution now. Sergio Oliveira. They've given it away. Sergio Oliveira. Marega. Flag up, tight offside. Showing a real will to win the ball. Mateo Kovacic. Sammy Abraham. Here's Kovacic. Inside the last quarter of an hour. And the poor touch didn't help them on the possession front. Well read to ease the pressure. Couldn't keep it. Marega. Mehdi Tarami. Oliveira. In it goes to rubber stamp it once and for all. Well, if there were any lingering doubts about the outcome, surely they now have been removed. Werner. The ball with Marcos Alonso. Tammy Abraham. Pulisic now. Sergio Oliveira. Kovacic, and he could cash in, and he's outdone himself, wonderful save there. Full time, and the issue has been settled. One